Hello everyone, and welcome to Dynamics 365 Portals Tips from Engineered Code. My name is Nicholas Hayduke, and this is tip number 14, Opportunity Distribution Engine in the Partner Portal. The Partner Portal is all about letting an organization's partners create and manage their opportunities. In this tip, I'll describe how an organization can have opportunities automatically assigned to an appropriate partner using the Opportunity Distribution Engine. The Opportunity Distribution Engine has two main stages. First, a list of partners that match the basic opportunity details is compiled. Next, those partners are ranked based on a number of different criteria to determine which one is the most suitable. A partner will be considered for an opportunity if all the following conditions are true. The partner has capacity, and the classification field on their account is set to partner. The current partner capacity field in the sales status section on the account form should be set when the partner is first set up and it should indicate how many active opportunities they can have on the go at one time. A workflow called Calculate Partner Capacity Workflow should be run after setting the current partner capacity to ensure that the Partner Has Capacity field is properly set based on the current number of active opportunities for that partner. The estimated revenue for the opportunity falls within the minimum and maximum range set in the Partner Info section on the account form, the territory of the opportunity is included in the list of territories covered by that partner. The lead type of the opportunity is included in the list of the lead types covered by that partner. And all associated products of the opportunity are included in the list of the products covered by that partner. Once the list of possible partners has been determined, they are ranked according to a formula, and the partner with the highest rank is assigned that opportunity. The ranking is based on the following properties. Distance, win rate, return rate, feedback rate, stall rate, touch rate, and average time to close. Each of these properties is weighted to determine the final ranking. You can see the value of many of these properties on the lead status section of the account form. The distance is based on the latitude and longitude of the partner and customer accounts, and requires the setup of the Bing Maps integration. It is also possible to include your own ranking criteria by using the partner ranking field on the account, and to modify the weights of each property by using site settings. To initiate the distribution engine, simply click the Ready for Distribution checkbox on the opportunity after filling in the necessary details. Please note that if you don't associate territories, lead types, or products to the opportunities, partners will not be filtered out based on those values. You need to enable the engine before it is used for the first time. This is done by creating a trigger distribution workflow action record, typically being an advanced find. The creation of this record will kick off a workflow process that runs the engine and will continue to do so hourly. Thanks for watching, and I hope you found the Dynamics 365 Portals tip number 14 from Engineered Code on the Opportunity Distribution Engine in the Partner Portal useful.